Hello, I'm Alexandr Balabanov, I'm 14 years old, I'm from Ukraine. I'm a singer, actor, and a young producer. I was born in Donetsk in 2006 and uh, came to Kiev in 2015 where I continued my music career. Twice before I reached the finals of uh, the national selection for Junior Eurovision, uh, but finally this year I had a great opportunity to represent my country at Junior Eurovision 2020 in Warsaw, Poland. Uh, it was truly one of the best experiences in my life. I played a leading role in the treaty show called Vintera, uh, where I performed for more than 70 shows live and where I uh, sang live in each show. It was really kind of challenging for me, but uh, after all, it was a really great and useful experience. In 2016, I first came to Meridian International School, where I performed at Ukrainian Festival of Language and Culture, and it led to uh, several years of uh, good friendship and after this all, uh, last year I joined uh, Meridian International School uh, for the ninth grade. I like studying there because of, uh, first of all, the friendly atmosphere between teachers and students and secondly, the ability uh, to learn all the subjects fully in English. So my IFLC history started back in the day when I was only nine years old and in 2016 again, I performed at UFLC and I won the selection contest. Uh, and I was singing a fast and catchy song. Uh, so I think that's why uh, everybody knows me and uh, I was invited to, to the IFLC festival. And later we got a call. I knew that uh, I was chosen to go to Brazil and uh, I was very happy about it, but I was only nine years old and uh, imagine going across the Atlantic Ocean without parents, uh, it might be kind of challenging. In Sao Paulo I uh, truly felt this uh, beautiful atmosphere of IFLC for the first time ever and it was really amazing. I met a lot of new people and uh, made friends with participants from all around the world. Uh, and uh, for me, actually, it was my first experience of uh, uh, speaking uh, live English because I, <laughs> I never had a, an opportunity to speak English uh, for all the time before. And uh, the most memorable moment of the trip uh, was uh, me singing from the rostrum of uh, the Brazilian uh, parliament, the parliament of uh, Sao Paulo state and uh, giving my presence and meeting the governor of uh, Sao Paulo state. My second trip was not less distinctive than the first one. I went to Australia, uh, the great city of Sydney. Uh, the flight was really long, uh, but I still enjoyed it because uh, it was something new for me. Uh, as always, I made a lot of new friends uh, that I'm still trying my best to keep in touch with. And uh, my little dream came true uh, because uh, for the first time I saw Australian kangaroos and koalas uh, uh, in the real life. <laughs> and uh, my third trip was taken to United States of America and Canada. It was 2019 and we gave uh, four incredible shows. Uh, in New Jersey, New York, Washington DC, and Toronto. Uh, and uh, at one of them, I even performed my own written song. And uh, it was really uh, kind of incredible for me. <laughs> Lockdown, we of course uh, lost an opportunity uh, to travel and everyone was so sad about it but uh, still we had uh, a lot of interesting projects from IFLC and uh, as before in previous years uh, and as now during the lockdown we sang a lot of songs for example like Gershiel Lotter and uh, Human by Ragnbone Man and uh, these uh, songs later are uh, going to either 
uh, IFLC online shows uh, during the lockdown or the live shows in different countries. IFLC plays a significant role in my whole life and career and uh, all these people and all these events will always stay in my heart forever. And uh, I hope that soon all of us will be able to reunite in real life and meet each other uh, as we did before. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye.